Hello, I am Dr. Sujay Kumar Shah. I am the co-chairman of Department of Cardiac Surgery and director of Card Cardiac Transplant at Gangaram Hospital in New Delhi. Today, we are going to talk about which patients are best suited to undergo a heart transplant procedure. Heart transplant itself is a complicated procedure and patients need to go through a rigorous selection process before we accept the patient to undertake a transplant. Ideally, this patient who has terminal heart failure should not have any other major organ system disease like kidney failure or liver failure or respiratory failure. Oftentimes, patients with heart failure will present with breathing difficulties to a chest physician and sometimes they get labeled as primary lung pathology. In these cases, you can see that there is difficulty in differentiating whether the patient's lung condition is secondary to heart failure or it is primarily a lung disorder. So by further testing, we can differentiate whether a patient's breathing would be improved by heart transplant or there would still be any problems remaining due to lung failure as such. In addition, the patient must be in a psychological frame of mind where the person is able to undertake the rigorous post-operation medication schedule and coming visits to the hospital schedule. Often these patients would be depressed and antidepressants can be readily used for the transient period after the heart transplant procedure. But patients with major psychological issues might not be the best patients for a heart transplantation. We also uh, do not propose transplanting patients who are older than 70 years of age, even though exceptions can be made for really fit patients who are over 70 and have only heart failure.